Hi, I've um, just picked up this power supply and I thought I'd have a, a quick play with it on the bench and one of the things I noticed was the the current control on it uh, to limit currents. Obviously if you're working on a circuit and you have an accident and short something out you don't want excessive current to flow or if you have components failed uh, on the circuit uh, you want to limit the current. Um, yeah, so I was sort of having a a look at this and what I find um, was at the moment I've set a, a current limit of 100 milliamp 12 volts and if you short the the outputs together which I'll do on my knee we can see we've gone into current limit at 100 milliamp which is very nice uh, but then what I did notice was that if you sort of let it there I mean at the moment with 12 volts and uh, if we just bring the old, uh, so we get quite a, a crack there. And I'm sort of thinking, well, that looks a lot more than 100 milliamp to me. And then I noticed, I don't know if we can capture this on the film, but if we just, yeah, you see, we uh, if we wait a little bit longer. I don't know if you saw that, but. There we go, try again. We seem to get quite a little current surge and just out of interest, I thought I'd pop a little light bulb on the end. So this is a, a 21 watt light bulb. And uh, yeah, we're at 12 volts. Can we see the light bulb and we'll make the connection. Get that in the shot as well. And you can see the, the flash of energy that's enough to illuminate a light bulb. Uh, you can also see the ammeter. Oh, what was that, 900 milliamp? So, so much for setting a 100 milliamp current limit. Uh, it does return to a 100 amp current limit, 100 milliamp, but I would say that they're limiting before the output capacitor, looking at the way that's working. And. Uh, not really what we was looking for. Now, bear in mind this can go up to 60 odd volts, which is a nice supply. That's actually, I was looking for the 60 volts to be honest. There we go, up to 62 indicated there. And again, if we can do that, that isn't what I would call a 100 milliamp current limit, sort of. Yeah, in fact, I think that's actually just taking the light bulb out. So, uh, as you can see, yeah, that's that's killed it. <laughs> uh, which was supposed to be 100 milliamp current limit. Oh dear, uh, is that a fail? Oh, it is in my book. I've got to admit, my other power supply uh, doesn't have that characteristic it will limit the current at the maximum that you set it. Uh, doesn't matter what voltage you're on.